The following video is sponsored by InstantMaddenCoins.com. The only place to get Madden Coins instantly on every console and platform is InstantMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again on a Monday afternoon, which means we have brand new team of the week players in Madden 17 Ultimate Team. And guys, the limited edition card this week is one of my absolute play favorite players, and that is of course Dez Bryant, the beast. Dez is just, I mean, this card is absolutely nasty, guys. Um, there are also Team of the Week packs in the game right now. We're going to open up one of those for you guys to see kind of what's in them. Basically, you just get two gold or better Team of the Week players, so it's not anything spectacular. But if you're trying to do the sets to get the heroes, um, you know, that's always something that you're going to have to do. So, um, the, the way that I wanted to do this today, I wanted to go take a look at this Dez Bryant real quickly because this card is really, 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 really good, guys. You're talking about a card that's going for about 700,000 coins right now. Let's see what the cheapest one is on the block. Uh, 690,000. It's a 93 overall. And guys, it has 90 speed, which I was a little bit surprised by because Dez is typically a player that they give lower speed to. He doesn't have the top end speed of some of the other guys that are the top receivers in the league. He's more of kind of like a physical guy that goes up there and makes catches in traffic. So what they actually did do is give him a little bit of a boost for that. He does have the deep threat chemistry, and it's a double chemistry, which means he automatically gets it. And now what you have here, when you have Dez on the field, you're going to give yourself plus one to throw power, plus one to spectacular catch, and plus one to throw accuracy deep. So you're talking about increasing that ability to throw deep by a pretty d decent amount there. Um, it does also cost you two for salary cap to have that in your lineup. So it's automatically enabled when you have Dez. So keep that in mind if you're building a salary cap team. Uh, this Dez would actually, I believe, go up to 40 automatically. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure it automatically does. So... Anyway, again, that is a pretty damn beastly card. We're going to try and pull Dez today, uh, but that is the one that I was really excited about. The other card that I was a little bit interested about, um, they do also have uh, an Eric Berry, which is the defensive hero, by the way, and Marcus Mariota, which is the offensive hero. Both those cards are very, very good. Um... Let's take a look at the Mariota real quick. I, I do want to uh, take a look at one of the golds as well because I didn't really have a chance to see it. Uh, so this is the Mariota Team of the Week uh, for this week. Very, very nice card. It does have, let's see here, the Ankle Breaker Chemistry. Uh, so that's nice. Take a look at the quick attributes here. 87 speed on a quarterback. That's obviously really, really good. Um, the throw power is an 89, so that's solid. Not amazing, but definitely solid. Uh, let's see here. What else do we got? Anything special. Okay, so let's see here. So, throw accuracy short is a 92, 90 for mid, and 84 for deep. And he has a 93 throw on the run with an 85 play action. I mean, this reminds me of last year when they put in a Mariota card, and it pretty much made the other quarterbacks almost irrelevant for, like, a pretty good amount of time. Pretty much everybody was running a Mariota. So, this thing's going for, let's see here, about 150000 at the moment. So, pretty good price on that. Uh, if you have the coins to spend and you need a quarterback... Definitely a good one to use, I would say. Um, now, the other card that I wanted to take a look at here, and I'm going to have to change some of the stuff within this here. Let me uh, do that. So, basically, guys, there's another really, really good card, I think, anyway, based on uh, just my quick look at it that uh, I'm interested in seeing, and it's a gold one, and it's CJ Procise. So, if, if you guys are not familiar with him, he's a player on the uh, Seattle Seahawks who is a rookie this year. And he actually got uh, a team of the week this week as well, an 82 overall card. Now, this is a guy who is possibly going to take over as their starting running back. I'll have to go back here and uh, find a different one. But he might take over as this team's starting running back. But if nothing else, he is a very, very good receiver out of the backfield. So I wanted to take a look here. So he does have 90 for speed, 87 for agility. That's very good. 90 for acceleration as well. His catching is a 78, which is very high for a running back. Let's take a look at, see what he has for, uh, like his, let's see here, his route running and things like that. I'm kind of interested in that. Spectacular catch is 71. Not amazing. Catching traffic is 65. I mean, these are all really good attributes for a running back. Um, they're not really comparable to top end receivers. But, you know, as far as if you're out there passing the ball every down, this is a good card to have on your team. Very high speed, great catching. Uh, route running is a 79. That's very good as well. So it, you're you're looking at a really nice player to have if you're a pass-first offense. I would highly recommend investing in this. It's very, very cheap right now. 
Um, I mean, you can get this thing for, what, 6,000 coins, it looks like. So, uh, the cheapest one's actually 3,700 right now on the PlayStation 4. So, uh, again, very, very nice card for very, very cheap. That's a, an easy budget card that you can work into your lineup and, you know, not have to really worry about him in the passing game, at least. Um, so, with that said, guys, what we want to do today, I do want to also open up... Uh, like I said, one of the Team of the Week packs. We do also have these Vertical Chemistry packs as well um, that guarantee you an Aaron Rodgers, apparently. I don't even know what the hell that is, but uh, we're going to go in here and open up the Team of the Week packs. Uh, we'll do one of those, and then we'll do maybe like a handful of pro packs. So uh, let's start that off. Guys, again, I do not recommend opening these things up with coins. I just do it for video purposes. I mean, I'm really not spending a whole lot of my coins this year. So uh, hopefully we're able to pull something decent. But again, I really do not recommend that you guys open these things up with your, uh, with your coins. So we get an alternate chemistry here. Uh, Alex Mack continuing on. Let's see here. Anything decent. Let's see some red. Let's see some red. So we get a Tony Lippett. This is probably the worst one that you could pull, to be honest with you. I bet it's probably the cheapest card of the whole bunch. But it's actually not that bad. It has 88 speed, um, 88 acceleration, good catching. So um, this is a card that's actually a, a player that's actually stepped it up quite a bit this year. So uh, good to see that. T.Y. Hilton there. Come on, Robert Blanton. Give me an elite, please. And we get the CJ Pro size. So we probably pulled the two worst ones that you could get for Team of the Weeks, unfortunately. Uh, but like I said, I like the CJ Pro size, if nothing else. I think that's a pretty na nasty card uh, for as cheap as it's going for. So. Uh, with that said, definitely did not make our coins back on the Team of the Week packs, but it only takes the one pull of a, you know, a uh, really good one or like a Doug Baldwin or something like that to come much closer. So, uh, and, and by the way, guys, there. let me take a look at this real quickly. Uh, Doug Baldwin, Alec Ogletree, Ryan Matthews, and Darian Stewart all have elite cards this week as well. So uh, very, very nice to have those. So uh, with that said, let's open up a couple more pro packs here and see if we can get anything before we wrap up today's video. Typically, we aren't pulling much out of these pro packs, but I figure it's worth a shot. And we do get a random Brian Dawkins gold uh, legend. So, I mean, that's actually not too bad. I know these don't go for a whole lot of coins, but uh, definitely better than a standard gold card. So uh, I'd like to see that and see if we get anything else. Nope. So, uh, all right. Well, we got Dawkins anyway. I pulled a legend, guys. Should I put that in the video title? I'm just kidding. We're not going to put that in the video title. <laughs> that would be some savage shit, by the way, if we did that. But uh, let's see here if we get anything else in any of these other packs. Marlon Moore. Herzlich. Come on. Daryl Smith. Damn it. All right. We're going to do, uh, let's do three more of these packs. We'll do five total of the pro packs. We already opened up the team of the week pack. So that'll give us what uh, about a hundred thousand or so a little bit more than a hundred thousand spent on coins in today's video uh, are on packs with our coins. And our final card is hello to nada. So nothing out of that one. Two more packs here, boys. See if we can get anything decent. If we can even pull a damn elite, it's probably not going to happen because Madden is just insane with the pack odds this year. It's like it's just ridiculous to try and get even one single elite card in this year's game. And we get a Kamar Ake in there. We got one more pack, guys, before we wrap up today's video. And I hope you guys have great luck pulling these today because, like I said, that Des Bryant is freaking nasty. If you pull that thing, you are, like, you're going to be very, very happy with it, I think. So uh, there you go. You get the Vince Wilfrick, and that is going to do it for our pack opening video today, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Sorry we didn't pull anything great, but that's just Madden this year. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did, do me a favor and drop a like on it, please. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let me know in the comment section below, guys, what are you pulling in your packs today? Did any of you guys pull Dez? If you did, tweet it at me, and I'll hit you with the retweet, all right? Thanks so much, guys. Hope you enjoyed it, and I will talk to you guys again soon.